What is up guys, Coach Attack here. So today we're gonna to be reviewing security camera from Netgear, it's the Arlo Q. Let's get to it. Now I'm gonna to try to make this video as informative and as, as quick as I possibly can. I'm not gonna bore you guys with details that are not important. So let's begin by the build quality of this product. Now, it's a, it's a, it's a decent build, it's a solid, it, it's a hard plastic, has a nice little like, smooth finish to it. Now, on the side, we do have a sync button, obviously to synchronize your product, as well as there, as well as there there's a uh, reset indicator LED. Now, on the other side, we have a two-way communication mic, so people could hear you and you could speak back to them. Uh, this product also features a USB device, micro USB to charge the device. Now in the bottom, there's two options. Uh, there's a little bracket where you could uh, install to hang up, to screw in your Arlo and hang it up, as well as you could remove it. And the good thing is it's magnetized. So you can just pop the, the magnets there. So you can just pop it to any magnetic service and voila, you're good to go. Now for the sake of this video and for the review, I'm gonna have screen recording enabled. So I want you guys to basically, I think it's gonna give you a better idea of how this essentially camera app works. So let's get to it. So obviously download the uh, Netgear Arlo first. So let's let's see, you know, hopefully I hope oh, Arlo. There you go, so Netgear Arlo pops up. So I have fingerprint enabled, it's a lot easier. Voila, it's signing me in. Boom, first thing I see is an option here for devices, I see live, I click on that, and then you're gonna see the camera work, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that a little later. Let's go to mode quick. As you can see, the mode is armed, right? We have four different options. We have armed, disarmed, schedule, and geoforce, geofencing. So basically, if you leave, and uh, come back to the uh, come back to your house. It's gonna turn on and turn off your camera. Basically, simplified as GPS system based. Now let's quickly jump into library. And now the library essentially is a timeline on what's going on in the uh, in your household. So if Arlo hears any sort of noise or motion, it's gonna send you an alert via email or via the app. And as you guys could see here, it, you know through the month of March and so on and so forth. I could just go all the way back, press play, and and see essentially what's going on. Now I wanna jump into the settings pretty quick. Let's go into the settings. Uh, let's click on my devices. Now here it's living room. So here you could name your device, you could turn on the camera on and off. You have the status light, it's just a solid light. I choose to always turn it off because you know you have a camera, why would you wanna indicate that it's recording? It's pretty cool. I turn it off and then you have your time, your flicker adjustment, and then video settings. Video settings are very important. This is where you get to play with the resolution. So here I have it at 1080p. Now guys, very important, this is a Wi-Fi based system. So essentially your internet needs to be really good, strong. So if you're gonna put it in a room where the internet is not gonna be as good, you're not gonna have a good service. So keep that in mind, it's very important. So we have 1080p, 720, 480, 360, and 240. 1080 the best, 240 the worst. <laughs> Whatever works for you guys, I have it at 1080. Moving on, we have different zones. We also have night vision, which is really nice. Night vision is not bad in this product. I like it, it's cool. You could enable it, disable it. Now let's go back. Settings now, audio settings. Now, of course, you have the microphone option. Uh, microphone is good, it's fun. You can, uh, if, if you, I don't know, if you have kids or a nanny, uh, you could definitely talk to them so they could hear you. The feedback is, it, it's all right. Um, you know, for, the, for this product, it's not bad out. Now let's go hit on uh, subscriptions. Now in the subscriptions, of course, you pay, you get more, you don't pay, you don't get as much. I'm gonna run you guys through that pretty quick. So the basic, as you guys could see, seven days of uh, video memory in the cloud, up to five cameras, I only have one, so it's not for me. Support, limited to three months. Uh, no CRV currently in the plan, which basically means continuous video recording. If that's something you uh, want, you do have this option. Let's just go to upgrade now and just exactly see if, you know, what's here. So we have the basic, the Premiere and the Elite. So we have the seven days of video memory and one gig in the cloud. We have the 30 days and up to 10 cameras and 10 gigs. And then we have the Elite, the most premium, 60 days of video memory and uh, up to 100 gig in the cloud and up to 15 cameras. So the more cameras you have, so, you know, you'll choose your own preference. And then we have a business option here. Yeah, again, more cameras, limited support, to be honest with you, business-wise, probably don't get this for your business. 
go with more of something um, uh, business savvy, in a sense, more of a proper security camera. This would probably be for, you know, in home, I would probably say. Go for something more industrial, you know, for business, uh, rather than, I'll probably say this, again, just my opinion, but I'll demo to you guys and, you know, we'll do this together. But yeah, you have these different options here, enterprise option, yada, 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 let's go back. All right, so we're back in the settings. Now we have buy and add-ons and accessories. So if you buy an accessories, so the basic means we have profile, grant access, device order, manage camera status, notifications, let's click on notifications quickly. So it tells you here what kind of no notification tone you want. We have crystal silent, yada, yada, a bunch of other options. Vib vibrate, so it's gonna give you that feedback of vibration. LED color, you could change that from all of these other colors. Uh, LED blinking frequency, we have high, medium, low. All right, so basically that's that. Simplified, again, something quick, something informative. Now this is very important. This is what I want to talk into, the quality. This is why you're watching this video. Screw everything else, you want to know how the quality is. Now again, as I mentioned before, this, in my opinion, probably wouldn't be something for your business. Also matters what kind of business you have. If this business has a lot of money, you probably, like I said, want to you know, invest a lot on your security. But if this business is, you know, probably, you know, probably just don't even get it for your business, honestly, because the quality is sub subpar, you could probably say. But let me let me demo let me let's demo the quality now. All right, so right now I'm gonna click on live, right? Let's see. Now it's buffering. You see, that's also a problem. You know, you want something instantaneous, you want something quick. This is you know, especially if you want this for your business, every second counts, it's gonna be buffering, you're gonna get robbed. Now the quality I said it's it's decent. As you zoom in, you get more noise. So you see here, I'm, I'm recording. This is my little setup. Oh, look at that. You guys got the little view quick. So as you could, if, as you guys can see, I'm zooming in and you see how much, there's so much noise, so much grain going on. So it's probably not the best for you to zoom in, but as I zoom out, the quality isn't too bad. But again, it's not something I would probably say that has the best quality setup. I would say it's okay. Now on the bottom, I just wanna show you guys something really quick. Now we have an option here to record. So if I click this, now the camera essentially is recording on what's going on. Now to the right of it is a screen. Basically what that means, a little um, camera, what that means is take a picture. Boom, I took a picture. Now here, this little light is to make the display brighter, lighter. And then this is for the, to, for the microphone. Since we're on the same screen, we just wanna give you guys a little quick demonstration of the uh, latency of, of basically of the little lag that you guys get so for instance if I move back you see it's I'm still in this image I'm still speaking now I just move back let's move forward you see I just came into this I just came into the screen right now for the camera so again it's something you know like I said it's you know the issue of the of the latency of the basically lag there is some significant lag but also i have really good wi-fi here i have files i have up to a, a you know the 800 meg so i'm not sure why it's like this but also just keep in mind that this product again from my opinion it's not something like secured secured for what you guys would think the quality is okay as i showed you guys there's a lot of cool customizing you could do with it but that's mostly that for the price, 450 bucks. Usually, it's always on sale for 150. I'd probably say try it, but something for like a security, home security, like industrial home security, definitely not, guys. It's definitely, definitely not. But that's that, guys. This is my review. If you like the vid, hit that like, hit that sub. I'll catch you next time.